it's Nancy today. Here I am outside in the sunshine. Oh, it is ever warm. I had to take off my I had to take off my sweater. I had to take off my knee socks. You see? It was hot in the sun. So, I think I'm going to learn how to play the banjo today. I am. Let's see if I can start this DVD. Click on play, and let's see what we can do here. Now let me see. I've got a music stand here. I think I'll put it on the music stand. I don't know what you can see at that angle. But we should get out our banjo now. It's $149 online. It comes with a book. And it comes with a had this other little thing. A tablature book. And this shows the well, I guess you can't see it so clearly. The rolls, forward roll. And they explains on the movie just how to um, how to read this. So it makes sense. So let's play our video. Well now I can't really play the video on here because it's going to be um, copyright infringement. But let me just do one of these rolls. This is what Billy taught me anyway. Okay, this is the forward roll. Now of course you can't see. The thing that is important here is not how to do it, but that I am 54 and I'm determined I'm going to learn how to play the banjo. I also have a fiddle at home, which I'm also determined to learn to play. I don't think you should just play one thing, you can do a few things. That's the forward roll. I like the alternating roll. Well, then wait, wait a minute. That was the forward roll one. And then we have the forward roll two, which is very similar. the forward roll too. In the alternating roll, I'm sorry you can't see my fingers. Let me see if I can lower this down a little bit. Oh, there you go. Now then, if I can tip it just a little bit without you falling off. I don't think I can tip it more without you falling right down. Okay. And now we have the alternating roll. Now, I don't know this one as well. Now, this is on. I don't think it's in tune. Okay, maybe it is. I don't know. I'm not going to worry about that. Thumb goes on the third string. One, two, three. So the third string that's called the tag roll. Well, I wasn't doing the tag roll, I was doing the alternating roll, but that is the tag roll. Okay, but let's keep in order. We're going to do, you see there? We'll do the alternating roll, okay? So you start on the third one with your thumb. I 
I did that right. Let me just do that neck again. The third string, the next string, first, the fifth string, first string, fourth string, and again. Let me see if I can do that again without messing it up quite so much. I like the sound of these. I, I like this. I like the sound of the the notes. Doesn't it sound pretty, clear and strong. And I don't need to use those picking things because I got fingernails. My word! Why would I want something weird sitting on my fingers? These are good. Then I know exactly what I'm doing. Okay, let's try this again. Start on the next to the, the third string. Second, fifth. And again. Then now the thing that I think would be difficult is to try and keep doing these pickings while you're also doing something with the other hand that's different and you're gonna sing it. Now that's just three times more than things I can do. So we'll just have to practice this for a little longer. I'll just get this part going. I like this alternate roll. So the only thing that changes, I guess, is this one. You go this one, and then instead of this one, you just move it up to here. Oops. Alternating roll. Okay, so we'll go and do the forward and back roll. And that looks like. You see that? I can't tell if you can see it or not because the camera. Okay, forward and back roll. This is the middle string. <laughs>
Evet. That was a wren. No, it isn't. What is that? I don't know what it is. There is a wren there. The birds are coming. Now that I'm playing the music, the birds are coming. Very interesting. There were no birds here. I think it was too hot. Let's try this again. do it so that when I do one series and I start the next series there's not a pause between them So you go up, hit that one, go down, and hit that one. 